Today we have a kielbasa sheet pan dinner for three dollars. Hey, Ridgeway, this is Lettuce Eat, and welcome to my channel. Today we have a kielbasa sheet pan dinner for three dollars from the Dollar Tree. Wow! And this will feed four with leftovers. That's incredible. This dinner is gonna stretch your dollar further to give you more bang for your buck to save you money by shopping the Dollar Tree. You can make all these fabulous meal ideas as long as you think outside the box and use Pinterest and Google to find all these amazing dinners. If you are new here, thank you so much for stopping by and clicking on my link. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you for viewing every single day. It means the world to me. If you are new, my subscribe guy just popped up. He is directing you to go ahead and like this video. So go ahead and smash that like button. He's also directing you to click on that subscribe word down below. Don't forget to tap on that bell because YouTube will notify you when I upload more video. Here's another awesome Dollar Tree dinner, gourmet style. You will need one of their smoked sausages, half of your onion from your pantry, I grabbed the California blend for the vegetables, and a can of their green giant potatoes, and I have my sheet pan ready. We're going to turn our oven on to 400, and we're going to let it preheat while we prep it. Let's go ahead and prep the onion. I'm only going to use half. Remove the peels. I have my garbage bowl in the sink to catch everything. I'm just going to switch knives here because I don't like this little one here. It's not doing the job right. Cut the onion down the middle and start slicing short and then long. I don't do a lot of sheet pan cooking. This is my first one. And I'm all for a few ingredients in a few dishes. That's good enough for the onion. I grab my sheet pan and I'm going to spray it with my butter spray. And then just dump all the onions all over the pan. I love easy, especially in the summertime. Now I went ahead and rinsed my knife and cutting board because you don't want to cross contaminate. I'm using my sponges less and less in the kitchen to wipe down things because again you don't want to cross contaminate. Just because you rinse it out doesn't mean it's thoroughly clean. I'm going to cut them into nickel sized pieces. If you have a larger family, two kill boxes would be perfect. Just watch your fingers. I'm going to take the kielbasa and sprinkle it all over the sheet pan. You can do this with kale. You can do it with 
green beans. Rinse my cutting board once again tonight because I'm going to open up my potatoes. Pour the sheet pan and then we're going to cut them down a little bit. Even if they're sliced, I'm going to cut them a little more. They're whole potatoes, not sliced. I'm going to let the water run over the potatoes for about a minute or two. You should always, always rinse canned vegetables. This is an insanely easy dinner. For very little money. Dollar Tree carries Green Giant canned goods, which is really wonderful. I've made potato soup with these. I made sausage potato soup with these potatoes. I whipped them and made a shepherd's pie. I will be putting my Dollar Tree dinners link in this description box below. The entire player's list. We're going to be seasoning the sheet pan with my favorite spices, pepper and garlic. wanted to get fancy you could add mustard or even a barbecue sauce that would be really good I will show you what the aerial view looks like when I'm done let's go ahead and get the vegetable blend opened I think with the potatoes about a half a bag would be perfect, and then I'll use the other half for another Dollar Tree dinner. Season it with three teaspoons of garlic. Then you're going to season it with three teaspoons of fresh black cracked pepper. Show you what it looks like. Here is what the sheet pan kielbasa looks like. And look at the pops of color from the carrots and the broccoli pieces. Yum! With the potatoes and the kielbasa. Another fabulous Dollar Tree dinner. Let's put this into the oven. Now keep in mind the kielbasa is already pre-cooked. I'm going to put it in for about 20 minutes until the broccoli is tender and cooked all the way through. My oven's just about preheated. I'm going to put it into the oven directly to the center of the rack. And we're going to time it for 20 minutes. I just took this out of the oven and look at the colors pop out at you. Yum. I'm going to 
put some on a plate, let it cool a moment, and we're going to try it together. I'm going to remove some from the pan here. You can serve this with a side of rice if you wish, or egg noodles. Either one would be good. Here's what it looks like on my plate. I'm going to let it cool about a minute or two and then we're going to try it. Let's give this a try. Look at that. It looks awesome. Mm. This is really good. That concludes today's Dollar Tree dinner, the sheet pan kielbasa, and it was absolutely amazing. It fed four for three dollars. That's incredible. We stretched that dollar further and we got more bang for our buck because we want to save you guys money. That is why I search the internet and Pinterest for these amazing recipes. And then I go to the Dollar Tree and buy the items there to make the recipes here for you at home and put the video up on YouTube for you to enjoy and duplicate these meals and reduce your food bill. If you are new here, thank you so much for dropping by and watching me all the way to the end. And thank you everyone for watching me every single day. I appreciate each and every one of you. My subscribe guy just popped up. He's directing you to like this video. So go ahead and smash that like button. Don't forget to click on that subscribe word below and tap on that bell because YouTube will notify you when I upload more video. Thank you and have a great day.